What's up guys, welcome to another episode of Sneakerhead213. Before I move forward, as always, hit that like button, comment down below, subscribe if you're new viewer, hit the notification bell so that you can stay up to date on my latest content. With that out of the way, let's get started on this really cool review. So these sneakers came out this past weekend, they retail for $220. If you were lucky, you didn't have to pay shipping, but I wasn't part of that lucky group, I had to pay shipping. Um, so all together was around like $230. Here is like the receipt. There's what I paid. And then here is where I bought them from, Packer Shoes. And then let's get started on this really cool unboxing. So as you can tell from the top of the box, it says Consortium there, two handshakes there. Um, and it has like a white paper finish on the back. Right here we have the Adidas branding there in black. Nothing here on this side, more of the Adidas in black. And then nothing on the bottom. And today we are doing the review on the Adidas NMD Racer times Juice. Um, and it is a US size 9.5. And, and it is a consortium there. So it is a consortium account. Um, so one of the first things I noticed is the box is a little bit different. Um, I'm not sure if Adidas has done this with other consortium collaborations. But I just noticed that it was different. You actually can slide this one out. As you can see it slides out here. And then right here, it says the respect is mutual, which is really cool. And on the inside, it says le respect is mutual, which is probably in French. And then it has it probably in Chinese down there. Um, so here it is, guys. The Adidas NMD Racer Times Juice. Very cool looking shoe. Uh, lots of details to talk about here shortly. Um, very nice looking shoe. And here is the other one. It's kind of a little bit smushed from being in the box during the shipping period. There it is. Very interesting looking shoe. The wrapping paper has a consortium handshakes there. Just in case you're wondering. These still haven't sell, sold out on many websites, so if you are interested, let me know. These are sold. I sold these particular ones. So... No, they're not up for grabs, sorry. Um, so like I mentioned, this is a collaboration between Adidas uh, latest model, the NMD Racer. This is the latest NMD model um, times Juice. Juice is a Hong Kong uh, streetwear boutique, sneaker boutique, um, where they sell pretty much either sneakers or like just streetwear clothing. And one of the most popular designs on their clothing and what's pretty much popular there is the I think they call it Alien Negra, Alien Negra design, and that is this kind of like etching here on the upper, like these different stripings here on the upper, the Alien Negra camo, I think is what they call it, and um, yeah, it's pretty much like a sig signature camo from a clot, so if you're familiar with clot, sneaker booty, um, and yeah, they decided to pretty much do like a laser, or not laser, but like a screen printed upper of that Alien Negra design. And like hints, this is like a silver color, and then there's the black there. Looks really nice, gives it a different style and flavor of look. On this side right here, you can see we have the three Adidas 3 striping there, which I didn't even notice at first, but now I notice it. <laughs> and it's in black. On this side, no uh, Adidas 3 stripes at all. Um, on the midsole, you notice we have these, the outsole kind of, you know, folding up towards the midsole and it has a black boost there. And then the pods, instead of being like on your regular NMD models out here or out here, it's more towards like the back heel and it is in a white pod there. I'm not sure exactly the purpose of that, but pretty sure it's something about performance. More on this side, more black boost and, um... From the toe box on up, we see the <clears throat> more of that Alien Negra type of, you know, screen print camo there. And then the shoelaces are very thin, and they're like a, you know, pretty much a black and white shoelaces. Um, and it says Adidas there on this side, and on the other one, it says Juice right there. That's their logo. Uh, right here, these little strips of uh, <clears throat> that hold the shoelaces down, they are made from... Uh, suede material so that's pretty nice black suede there um and then right here on the tongue we have the adidas branding there and it's being held down by the consortium um 
rivet there that they always do and this is like you know metallic silver on the bottom you see there the juice logo there and then the, the it has like this elastic band to kind of like stretch it out so you can you know put your foot in there and uh, it actually says consortium on the inside and the insole I believe is leather let me check let me make sure yeah it is leather it's like a no it's not leather it's like a I don't know it's almost like a suede type material and white not really though and then there isn't any padding towards the heel on the back so that's kind of strange there really isn't much support on this shoe that's why it sinks down like this that's kind of one of the disappointments I had there isn't really much support so it just kind of sinks down like a sock uh, that it came with extra laces that are with the gray hints and mostly white and it has the same aglet branding as the black ones um, what else guys here on the back this pull tab it says alien negra and oh you can actually see it right there alien negra there and I'm not sure if I'm pr pronouncing that right but that's how I imagine it is pronounced and also here around the heel cup we actually have suede which is very nice for a change as I mentioned I wanted to see different materials and I guess they are starting to put different materials on their NMDs um, the outsole guys is your regular NMD racer outsole if you're not familiar with it <clears throat> where it has the textured like camo like here uh, you know towards the toe box for extra better grip when when using it as a lifestyle shoe or running and it's translucent so you can see the alien negro design there and then the rest is just like this textured um, pretty much uh, rubber outsole it would have been nice to make these since you're paying the 220 it would have been nice for this to have been you know that the same kind of outsole continental outsole from the ultra boost but it's not and it's an all white the adidas branding there nothing special and it is kind of concaved in which is something different but other than that guys that's pretty much it here's the other one guys there's the other one let's get a thumbnail real quick before we end this video these do fit true to size but i recommend maybe going down half a size because um, right here, since there isn't any support, it's kind of very snug, and you can see as I pull it up, it'll it kind of falls down a lot on your on your uh, on the top of your foot. So I, I would I would recommend maybe going down half a size, but like I said, I would recommend you guys try it on first on a store um, if you can see it if you find them in the stores. But um, yeah, that's that's my thoughts on the sizing. My thoughts on the shoe. It's a really nice shoe. I like the different material usage they had on this. The NMD Racer, however, isn't my favorite silhouettes. Um, I'm just not a fan of like the concaving here on the midsole, and I don't know. I just it kind of looks a little bit weird to me. But that's my personal opinion. But overall, I would rate the shoe probably a a good seven out of ten. Um, but I would be willing to bump it up to an eight because of the details it has. But just like the style of it, like how it bends up like that. You see how it's naturally just up like that. I don't really like that. It kind of looks weird to me. But other than that, really nice shoe. Oh, and right before I ended, this one had this insole has juiced and Adidas branding there, so that's really nice. But other than that, it's really nice shoe. Um, let me know what you guys think. Comment down below, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and we will see you guys on the next one. Peace.